Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel Agri Addict. So we are again back with another university which we are talking about today is Dapoli. So we have like one of the students from the Dapoli who is pursuing like MSc from the biotechnology. So he is here to provide the valuable information for to all of you who will be coming up with the ICR counseling in the coming years including 2026. So from this video, the students who are willing to take the admission and uh, wanting to know about the different universities, their status, the hostel facilities, the academic facilities, the teaching facilities, the library, the overall environment, the campus field and all other related things. So that is what we are going to discuss in this video. And so this video will be a lot more beneficial and useful for all of you if you are willing to attend the counseling in any of the upcoming years. So stick with us till the end and uh, we will be discussing each and everything in detail. So this will definitely help you and if you have any queries or doubts related to this campus, you can always comment on this video and we will be happy to assist. So Arsha, uh, welcome you to this session. So thank you so much for sparing your valuable time and uh, guiding yes, your juniors. So firstly, like before we start, I would request you to please yes. give a brief introduction about yourself. Sir, myself for sure then. I, I, I have, I have uh, completed my BS degree in uh, uh, University of Agriculture Science Raichur in Karnataka. I'm basically from Karnataka and I'm pursuing my MSc in uh, discipline, biotech discipline, molecular biology and biotechnology uh, in Maharashtra. That is uh, Dr. Uh, Dr. Bala Sahib Savant Konkan Krishi Vidya Pit Dhapoli, okay. Ratnagiri. Okay, and, so this uh, is like your, you are at the end of your MSc, like you'll be completing your MSc soon. Uh, uh, I have, uh, I'm in senior MSc. I think uh, in, two, in July, I will be completing my MSc. Okay. Uh, and uh, and uh, submission of uh, uh, my thesis will be at July 31st. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much for the brief introduction. And uh, thank you again for being here. So like, let's discuss about your campus. So that students will get a lot of, uh, should get a lot of information and the right information, the clarity regarding whether to choose the university or not. Mm -hmm. So firstly, like uh, tell me about yourself, like you, you are through like NTS, like you're getting the NTS fellowship. Yes, sir. I am from NTS. Uh, like I have, uh, I have uh, written JRF, but okay. I didn't get JRF, and I got NTS. Okay. And uh, I came here through mock up round because I didn't uh, ten thousand. I didn't pay ten thousand fees okay. for that. So I directly added mock up round because of that. Mm -hmm. Because I didn't want to go, go for MSc, and after that, uh, due to my pressure from family, so I came here. It will force and, uh, So it along with tech. MSc, I'm, I have also. Uh, sir, uh, why, <laughs> why did you choose BTech? Sorry, MBB, Biotech. Sir, Biotech, it's very like, uh, very technically, it's very technique, sir, technically. So, and it's very qualification, it requires high, high qualifications and high skills. Mm -hmm. So, I think according to me, it's very good for compared for me. Okay, like for the future, like for your future, like you felt it like it's a very good department that you have to focus on that's why you have chosen like mbb that's good that's great ah, sir uh, when i was small i think i i wanted to be in uh, labs like uh, in acs and okay. labs along with the uh, la lab codes so i thought it would be good so that's, inter that's and interesting yeah, okay. so let's start about your campus like how is the campus feel the environment the surrounding the location like what do you want to comment on this so i think campus is uh it's like uh, very good and uh, when compared to along with fitness, there is also gym, we can go and uh, there are two to three grounds and uh, along with campus, there is, it is very uh, compact and uh, in, uh, and very uh, like uh, eco-friendly because behind the uh, uh, university, there is forest and it is very like, uh, you will get fresh air daily when you okay. get up. And so uh, it's very you are basically having sorry. like very good natural environment around you and the campus is quite ah, big. Natural, and it's it very is very natural. And ah. eco-friendly ah, mainly. Ah, so you, you will get that proper campus feel at the Dapoli. Okay. So yes, sir. Uh, I think uh, compared to US Raichur, uh, both feels good, sir. Because uh, in US Raichur, it is very uh, highly sunny. Uh, sunny, sir. We will get, I okay, think, 42 to 43 degrees. And the only Celsius, problem at Dapoli is summer like during summer. Season. So the problem with the Dapoli ah, in rainy season just... and humid, sir, during okay. summer. Okay. In so humid, because it is near, uh, uh, ah, sir, student because uh, they are traveling from other uh, state, no, sir. Uh, 
they will get some adjustment for uh, two to three months. And mostly so, like as we discussed, like, uh, students mostly come from Karnataka, Kerala, Tamil Nadu and very less students from the North India. So this is the current trend till now. Like this is how much like how the st- ICR students are coming. And as such, like there is any partiality sir, between the ICR students and the state students uh, in your campus. Like this is what is something no, sir, it's not students like are that. very much worried uh, about. Since you are ICR student. No, sir. No, sir. There is no, they will prefer, uh, they will prefer ICR students, sir, because, uh, uh, because uh, it's very because uh, uh, because we are coming from uh, ICI, JRF exam. exam no, sir. Got it, got so it. it's quality. very uh, it's very complicated than the MS uh, Maharashtra seat here. So okay. they will prefer uh, uh, ICR students, and uh, they will also help us, sir, because uh, we don't know Mara, uh, Mara, Marathi here. Marathi. So they will also pro- they will also help you to uh, they will also teach language. They will talk with you with you when you are in your convenient language. Okay, it's not right. like that you have to speak 100 percent marathi here yeah it's very That's, convenient okay so it's completely like you friendly student friendly environment so no as ah, it's practical very problems that the students, students are, uh, they are friendly. yeah regarding the hostel let's start about the That's regarding right. the hostel facilities tell us about the fee structure tell us about the facilities that you get in the hostel and the food uh in case of fee structure uh for initially we are for each sem we have we will be paying eleven thousand for uh, staying and along with uh, light bill and water bill and after that uh, for uh, if we are going to if we are going to have uh, vehicles we will be providing driving license and uh, the uh, uh, xerox copy of uh, vehicle certificate like okay. uh, for uh, convenient it. because if yes. there is any uh, sir and uh, in case of uh, mess it is very good because we will be receiving three times a meal mm-hmm. uh, in the day and uh, along with the tea in breakfast. And must be so, around like 3,000 to 3,500. Uh, uh, 3,000 to 3,200. I, I am paying 3,200 now. Okay. So it's very convenient, sir. Mess mm-hmm. bill and uh, everything. So overall, like I can say that in 1.5 lakhs, like uh, you will be able to complete your MSc. Ah, sir. Uh, yes, sir. 1.5 lakhs. Okay, and Along like is there any the fee structure of uh, uh, academic fees of like semester wise fees? Like you will be able to complete within like one point five, or maximum like even if students are making the self expenses, like they can go up to like two. That's it. No, sir, it's not like that because uh, when compared to college fees, it's around uh, eighteen to twenty five mm-hmm. for normal departments, and in case of biotech, it will go up to thirty two mm-hmm. in uh, last year or fourth years. And okay. uh, each sem we will be paying, I think, uh, twenty-two to twenty-five thousand, and I think it will be one lakh. And for uh, uh, mess, it will be like uh, in each uh, like in forty thousand. And uh, in between, uh, in two lakh, it will be completed so along yeah, with yeah, your uh, uh, our own uh, expense. It's, uh, yeah, it's like most like two at par. Yes, so that's what students have to know, right? Like if they are only ah, two at par. Yes, sir. Yeah. Ah, ah, okay. Sir. Got if it. you want to travel, you can go within the two lakhs. Yeah. So, and it's very uh, here places are very good sir okay for very traveling. good places to travel and uh, spend some free time and regarding the hostels like uh, how it is allotted time, sir. allotted uh, in case of uh, in, it's based on uh, merit sir like okay. uh, we will be getting uh, good rooms for uh, high merits and uh, in case of icr we will be receiving separate uh, rooms which will be very uh, clean compared to other rooms mm-hmm. so icr they will prefer a more icr sir the preference, like the privilege or the uh, like, very good treatment for the ICI student, like it's purely based on the merit. That's it. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Ah, sir. Initially, like first single when we room or double go for first year, when we single seater, sir, single seat from MSC itself, like you get the yeah, single only single. one for each. Okay. Okay. Got it. Ah, sir. So there is any shortage of hostels in the coming years? Is there anything that is concerning or like or shortages of hostels are sufficient that uh, whoever is taking the admission, everyone can get the hostel. Ah, sir, uh, for uh, uh, there is like a uh, uh, restriction, sir. Here. Mm-hmm. So, when compared to uh, like I in compared to Karnataka here, no, no, like I mean to there ask like a shortage of hostels, so they are, they are restricting. Uh, what I mean to say, no, is sir, like... there is no, sir, there is no shortage. There is... Okay, everyone who is taking that mission, they'll get the hostel for sure. Yes, sir, they will be getting hostel. Yeah, but the restrictions you told me, like, there I just are extra rooms, sir. Yeah, okay, got it. 
So there Absolutely. are like sufficient uh, space, like and also like Absolutely. every student like who is coming to the admission, they will definitely get it. There is no assets problem, though. Ah, uh, uh, and also each room, to... separate rooms for the yeah. Okay. So as you mentioned, like uh, the students Absolutely. have to know this. Like there is some proper restrictions on the hostel timings and everything. So if you are very free, like at your UG and uh, like uh, expecting that your PG will be so, like uh, make sure like you know this that at Dapoli like you have like timing based uh, input like going out and in of the campus. And of the hostel, even for the boys awesome. and girls, like the times awesome. is like time limit is like up to 8 p.m. Where you up, uh, above 8 p.m. Like you can't really go awesome. outside without any permission. So this is what you have to know it. And whatever you spend, whatever sir, we you can like, go, sir. But uh, it uh, should be convenient reason. Okay, yeah, that's what like uh, with the proper reason. Like we, we have, have to, to provide to... convenient reason for uh, going outside after 8 p.m. Yeah, yeah, got it. So this is what the students have to know about the hostel. The facilities are good, the rooms are good, the food is good, the fee structure we have discussed and overall like, campus feel is good. Next about the academics, like I'll just convey like whatever you have like discussed with me already. Like uh, related to the academics, like uh, academics can be differentiated into like teaching and uh, research field. So the Arsha has mentioned like in case of teaching, similarly like what we have discussed in Parbani and Ravori, more priority is given to the research, not just to the teaching. So if you are like wanting to get, get some very yes. good knowledge about the subjects, then you have to focus on your self-study. The library facilities are also available and they are good. So you need not, there is no access yes. lacuna in the facilities. Like it is user friendly, but you can't expect, really expect that uh, the right. UG kind of classrooms and like UG kind of classes that will be regularly taken on, taken up. You have to be sure, like you have to be sure that, like uh, make up your mind that the classes will not be as such. So you have to make your self-study. And the rest, like research facilities are good. It depends on the funding. Overall, that the major departments like the genetics, plant pathology, entomology, pathology, agronomy, soil science, and also biotech. They are getting, they are making good progress in all of these departments. As you mentioned, the students can also prefer to go for IS studies. They can do some quality work in their um, field. Otherwise, like if the students are preparing for the government exams, still the, the ample amount of time will be given available with them so they can go to the library and prepare accordingly and overall if i talk about the enrollment uh, the students uh, trend or what is going on many students are like 90 approx 90 percent of students are the state students rest 10 percent are icr students so mostly the state students will prepare for the state government exams central government exams like mostly competitive exams and in the 10 percent of the icr students also Mostly the students like who are interested in subjects, they'll look into the ICR exams of PhD and they'll properly work on the research either to go for the private sectors or to be as a AP or the AR scientist uh, or to be in this field of uh, their subject. Or else like again, the same trend that uh, they will yes. be also focusing on the government exams, the different government exams. They'll try to balance between the both, both the academics and also regarding the exams yes, connections. Right. So this is what we have known uh, by yes. Asha till now. So apart from the academics, uh, library facilities are good. What about the extracurricular activities? How do you bust your stress? Extracurricular, like uh, the, uh, every year there will be sports, sir. Mm -hmm. And uh, like uh, everyone can participate and uh, each and every sports, sir. It's very okay. convenient, sir. Okay. For uh, like the yes. facility, like it's very, they are very friendly, sir. Mm -hmm. Ah, sir, grounds are available, sir. They are also having tracks here mm -hmm. and along with the badminton and the table tennis courts, separate, mm -hmm. separate courts. Okay. And uh, it is very convenient to if they are uh, national players for uh, practicing here because mm -hmm. uh, and uh, each and every athletic uh, games are here and uh, they will prefer because uh, uh, if you are uh, if you are good in any of the particular sports, they will prefer you uh, when compared to others because most of them here are studying so uh, less will be play, uh, less will go for playing. So if you are highly qualified in particular sports, you can directly enter into it okay, without it any uh, dis uh, dissatisfaction. So extracurricular ah, activities are also good. You mentioned about the gym. You mentioned about the sports. The things are ah, always, always available, and the campus feel is good. And a few more things ah, I sir. wanted in to ask. In case of cultural events, of... it's yeah. very good. Okay, in case of cultural events, please. Ah, sir, it's very good, sir. We we can directly participate and we can provide the number of names uh, names of these uh, groups so we can directly pass, participate. And uh, uh, before that, we will be going for rehearsal and after that, we can participate. It's yeah. very convenient, sir, for uh, cultural and sports. Yes, like it's encouraging also. Like students, if they are interested, they can also participate in. Ah, they, they are encouraged. Yeah. Okay. So overall, like ah, the sir, campus ah. feel is always there. Like it's like every basic facilities that is required ah, for the students, sir. it's there. 
Okay. So that's fine. Next about the yes, cutoff. Sir. Like usually like if I ask you about the approximate the ranks the students come in, like what is the range of rank that the stu- from the ICR students like take the admission at your campus uh, across the departments, if you know. ICR, sir, in case of uh, mine, uh, I, I had, I think, uh, ICR uh, like 366 uh, rank, sir. Mm-hmm. In case of biotech, I okay. got, I think, uh, 130 marks in uh, mm-hmm. ICR exam. Mm-hmm. And uh, so I got, I think, 330 rank. And uh, at the mop up round, I got uh, because I didn't add it, uh, that 10,000. So I thought that it was uh, uh, in case of Karnataka CT, there was not, not like that. So I, I thought that it would be. There is be there will be no payment. Mm-hmm. So at at the time of mop up round, I got to know that we have to pay ten thousand for the successive rounds. Okay, now so experts are getting initially all the at sir. first round I got uh, uh, NG Ranga sir okay. and for uh, uh, physiology plant physiology. Mm-hmm. So the uh, plant physiology was not convenient. So I uh, sir cut off. Uh, I think. Uh, in case of uh, ICR, I know that uh, I got, I think, three, 336 rank, sir. And uh, in case of other cutoffs, I don't know about that, sir, because uh, I didn't uh, prefer the MS if, uh, in my head, sir. So uh, I thought that it would be, if it like is, yes, it would be going, like, if, if it is, no, there friends, like, from the other departments, if you know about your friends from the other departments, so what is, like, uh, approx the ranks they have? I think in case of uh, uh, most of them are in from uh, MC, MCRT, sir. Okay. So state. they have their separate cutoff for that mm-hmm. uh, in each department. So uh, in case of Maharashtra, uh, in case of ICR, sir, uh, uh, in uh, like uh, within thousand, I think yeah, they will within be thousand. Like they can expect ranks. Uh, okay, got it. Okay, fine. So next, next like regarding the placement, uh, within, I think uh, five hundred five. Yeah, thousand would yes, be like more high, like uh, very high. Mean, like five hundred is like okay, like three hundred to five hundred. Like if they are getting like they uh, can expect five hundred. Five hundred. Okay. Yes. Uh, so uh, next so thing is because about the most uh, like uh, only one seat is remaining. Sir. Mm-hmm. In Tapoli, sir, only one to two seats are available for ICR students. So okay. it is highly uh, uh, less in in Maharashtra for ICR mm-hmm. students. Okay. Uh, sir. Okay. Got it. So regarding the placement, I wanted to ask, like, is there any placement cell active, which is, is active at uh, the poly or any private uh, companies are coming to the universities for taking the students or getting the students are getting placed. So right now, I don't know, sir, because, uh, M- for MSc, I don't know about that, sir, because mm-hmm. in case of uh, UG, they will be coming for uh, placement, sir. Mm-hmm. And uh, after four, I think every year they will be coming. And uh, most of them are from uh, uh, private, sir, because uh, like Syngenta and others, and other uh, starting they are. Uh, but this is not followed for MSNBS. They, they it's not a common trend. Ah, sir, it because uh, most of them are uh, like uh, they are only fixed for a PhD and uh, government uh, particular exams. like uh, research, and they are going for. Uh, it is not uh, like uh, they will be 100% going for placements. So there will be less placements for okay. MSc and PhDs. Okay, got it. I guess like we have discussed uh, most of the things which are needed for to uh, needed from the student and to be known. So still students, like if you have anything else to ask regarding uh, the polio or if you want to clarify anything, you can always comment on this video and uh, Asha will be always available. So whatever he knows, like whatever he can yes, explain in the best capacity, we'll always do it and he will support his juniors. The as I always say in every video, like the struggle we faced, where there is a lack of information about the different universities. At least you sh- you people should not have it. That's that's why we are coming coming up with this video, taking a lot of time trying to connect with the students who are like pursuing their MSc, PhD, and they are like actually sparing their valuable time in this peak time because if you know like uh, now it is a peak time for the MSc students who will be submitting their thesis and they will be moving on to the higher studies or looking for the next career. Still, the like students are making time to like. Uh, come up with the video like where they are providing the detailed review so thank you so much for all the support you people are doing thank you so much and students like if you have anything to uh, else to ask as i told you you can comment yes, so yes. if you like the approach well if you like the efforts we are making please like comment share and subscribe our youtube channel thank you so much mm-hmm.